السلام عليكم ورحمة الله دلوقتي معايا E60 دايرة اهي بمفتاح وهعمل لها التاني اللي هو ده Hello all now I'm having that E60 with that working key and I will add this one this car is having um, much more issues um, as on the previous video these these switches was working uh, the left for the right and the right for the left and we coded it uh, also here that working key the remote does not work and also if I test it here for the frequency you don't get anything also the battery I replaced and nothing at all so the new one if I test it you see 350 I'm not sure that the remote on this key will work uh, maybe because this car um, maybe the starting kit has been replaced earlier because the VIN on the CAS and on too much modules is different than the actual VIN on the car itself so if I insert that key with the logo I can turn the ignition on as you see off again if I insert the new one okay As you see here, key is not programmed yet. So using CGDI BMW, I will add that key. Or turn the light on again. Uh, so I will insert the working key. Also turn the radio off. then go to CGDI yes current key is 4 Frequency is 315. Key has been removed. Test. You. Now, I'm having we we'll recover these two. Well, yes. Also that one. Yes. Also that one. Yes. Just to delete all keys. Open. Insert the key. Ignition on. So only number four key. If I read key info again, OK. 
okay. Test that one, then save. You see here, unused, unused, unused. We'll add my key here. Generate, please put the blank key into the, C the coil of the CGTI. This is the blank key, put it here. Let's see, okay. Uh, no programming key, programming key success. Now we'll insert the new key. Notice here, can turn ignition on. We'll start the car. Also, the car started successfully, and out at this moment. This car is only having these two keys. The engine here is having some issue. We'll stop. Then take out the key. Now remote lock and unlock. Work it. Okay, that's it. Hello all. Now. Uh, I have here three keys. This is the original working key number four and that one that I had uh, programmed for the car and this one is uh, a proximity comfort access key original one which I had renewed earlier. If I insert that one notice you can get the airbag light and on open if I insert that one, good. If I insert that one, which is without a mechanical key, key is not programmed. Now I will see the eye is connected. Open the software, yes. Pass one, two, three. Read key info. Reading data. Nothing is there. Okay. Test E60, then save. Now I will say generate dealer key, confirm. Okay, we'll use key number one. Okay, generate dealer key. We'll put that one without the mechanical key and say okay here i will say yes because it's a smart key yes programming key programming key success now i need to notice here i need to insert the key turn ignition on also start the car the car started successfully Switch ignition off, then I will push brake, then try to start from here. Notice, work it. So, here, turn that off, off, push brake, start it once again. Maybe I need to insert it again once, then take it out, start, 
nothing we'll try that way started okay we'll take it out then start now started maybe it also needs to repair keyless key so ignition off engine off I'm sorry okay I didn't press break yet we'll press break and try mm. don't work okay <laughs> 